I used to say he was a person with nine lives, and I'm not sure how many he had. He loves uh, uh, La Vespa, the bike. He loves diving. He loved food. I think everyone who knew him would have to say he was eccentric. His mind was on other, you know, on more higher things, I think it was fair to say. <laughs> Collector, old instrument, new instrument. He spoke five languages. He was he's a genius a bit, <laughs> of course. <laughs> I was always more interested in violinists, frankly. There was one Schubert piece where you cross arms at the end, I remember that. <laughs> and he produced that and we played that and I said, oh yeah. <laughs> <You know? laughs> I've come to the RNCM to enjoy ensemble bassoon playing, my perfect idea of bassoon sound. I'm... Um William Waters International Chair. When we decide to create this uh, Grazie Bill event, I said, we need Sergio. And he asked me just to come here to play together and dedicate these two or three days to Bill. The way we rehearsed completely kind of switched. He picks out on absolutely everything. There is never one single note without direction. The guys was a little bit scared about it. What happened here? It's completely crazy, it's completely different. Yes. Nani, nani. I think the best explanation of what we are doing is we exchange uh, opinion, taste. They say, excuse me, can I play your part? What do you think about this? Now you. Ah, yes, good. Ah, it's also nice. And that's, oh, wow, pam, exchange. I want to play Pasolini. I do first the left hand. Would you? There's nothing to beat a group of bassoons. Some instrument clash sometimes. The bassoon never. Velvety, warm, it sort of gets all round you. Sergio decided to play many, many transcriptions. When they first told us we were doing a flute piece for bassoons, I think all of us kind of went, OK. It just works so well. He's the best thief in the world. And probably he, he goes to the jail very soon. If you start to play thinking competition and win competition or job, you are in the wrong way. I'm trying to create something different here. This city and this college make some special energy. The people come to feel something special, for passion, for love. I try to immediately take the, the young player into the music. I think yesterday, for example, during the rehearsals, Nobody was thinking about the job. And this is our duty. I mean, Sergio, mine, Roberto. What I try to do only is to find a connection between all these person. I said, play as you feel. You respect the composer, yes, but you have just to talk about also yourself. He plays one note and it's got a beginning and an end and it's perfect. And Bill was like that. He, he would be saying something through sound, which is, of course, what sound is about. It's maybe only in your head or in, in your heart. It's amazing when it's been so intense, but everyone's been smiling basically the entire time. Today we have a little concert. The performance will be not perfect, it will be improvisation. We're so lucky to have a department of amazing teachers and what makes them all amazing is that they're all so different. These people, they're very, very fine musicians. They breathe music as they play, I suppose you could say. They're trying to get us all to leave college feeling like we can just play like ourselves and play in a unique way. I think that's what makes it really special. Well, it's, it's to do with the 
people working here and the, the spirit. He'd be delighted to see numbers of bassoon players up here. Certainly he would, yes. I want not to be too mystic. Uh, he's a guardian angel of every bassoon player. <laughs> <laughs>